five nights at Maggie's four. I don't know what happened to the first f f three games, but no one cares. I played this. Uh, I actually played this for one for the first night, and and I don't know what happened. Hi, this is an automated voice message to instruct you on how to do your job here at Flowers Burgers and Pizzas. First of all, we'd like to welcome you to the company. You are now part of Flowers Entertainment as the night guard of the pizzeria. Isn't that great? Flowers Burgers and Pizzas is a new and improved Maggie's Magical World with old and new friends, such as Flower, Peter, and Timmy. A place for the whole family. Flowers Entertainment is not responsible for any damage, injuries, or accidents to the person. As you can see, you have been provided with a tablet where you can do different things. First of all is the cameras and audio system. In this panel, you can use the cameras to see if there is someone or something on the pizzeria, and you can use the audio to distract the person that might have come in. Second is the movement detector software. If you can't see but suspect there is someone on the pizzeria, then you can use the movement detector to confirm if there is someone moving around the pizzeria. And third, the ventilation system. As you have noticed, you have a carbon monoxide meter which shows you the CO levels on your office. If a vent happens to have any sort of problem, this number will start to go up. And when it reaches 800 parts per million, you will pass out and die due to carbon monoxide poisoning. But don't worry, the ventilation system is there to fix any problem with the vents. Only click on the vent that is malfunctioning and hold the button until the vent reaches a number above 30%. You are legally not allowed to talk to anyone about the vent system. If you decided to do so, then we'll see you in court. <laughs> Now, let's we'll talk about the animatronics. These animatronics have a new technology, which if they detect an intruder on the pizzeria, they will start to move and try to stop him. The thing is, the animatronics are not code to recognize the security guard, so they will see you as an intruder and try to stop you. With the movement detection software, you can see if they are close to you or they are far away. You will not see them on the cameras because they seem to not like it. You have a locker room behind you, which you can use in case one of the animatronics enters the office. If you start to see or hear any flickering of the lights, hide on the locker, and if you see them in front of you, close your eyes until they go away. This only works on Flower, Peter, and Timmy. Surti and Jerry will move too, but it's because they have another recognition system, which has been recycled from the old endoskeletons, which is the sound recognition system. If they hear sound, they will go to the place where the sound is coming from, aka your office. You cannot see them on the movement detector software. But you can see them on the cameras, and you can use the audio system to get them far away from you as possible, because they will find you even if you are hide on the locker. And then there is another one, but you don't really have to worry about it because he seems to not be working. But if you see it, he will enter to the vent system. Once he do that, the vent where he entered will start to malfunction. If this happened, the only thing you have to do is to fix the vent where he entered, and he will go away that easy. That's everything you have to know. Good luck, and remember, here at Flowers Burgers and Pizza, everyone is important and have a great role on the pizzeria. So if you don't do your job as you have to, you will be fired. Good night. Alright. <coughs> what is the move? Uh, I think it was Flower that moved. By the way, you can download this game on on your phone. It's free and well, it only has ads when you die. But I turned off the I turned off my Wi-Fi, so suck it. You won't get paid. <coughs> okay. Also, if you don't know, I'm sick. I have a cold. It was, it was my first day of school as well, but yeah, I don't think it will be. Yeah, I don't think anyone will like will like it if I infect the school with this. What's sick? <coughs> or, oh, there's someone in the person's room. No! Where's the bathroom? Go there. <coughs> okay, 
the P PPM. I don't know what that thing is. Blink, blink. I guess I close my eyes when someone enters my room as enters the room as well. What was I supposed to do? I'm new and improved. You sound like you're old. <coughs> I'm gonna have to search up on the Wikipedia. Wait, give me a minute. All right, I'm back. I literally had to go to Rexter's YouTube channel, you know, Fusion Z Gamer's brother. I went to his YouTube channel. <coughs> To see how to do it. And apparently you have to close your eyes as well. And I guess there's a blinking light to signify there's an animatronic in front of you. Hi, this is an automated voice message to instruct you on how to do your job. Thing. <coughs> but you know... <coughs> oh my gosh, oh my, I'm getting worse. Well, you know... The vent mechanic is pretty interesting, you know, like I have to hold them in the pair though. That's pretty interesting. I was like, oh. When I, by the way, when I first tested this out, I was like, oh, that's cool. I can just blink. But no, you can hold it down and like actually. Like, like, Big boo. I can't honk the nose. Also, I have three vents in my office. Is that? Oh my gosh, I'm stupid. Those are the vents that the animal trunks use to come in. <coughs> okay, that's it. There's one in the party room, okay? And one in the bathroom, okay? That's just. Yeah, people need a break, but poo poo. There's one in the. in CJ, in C and J's. C and J room, okay. Oh, Jerry and the other character, I forgot the name. Let's see, uh, the kitchen, I guess? Meh. 1 a.m. When you see an animal trying to be fun, you close your eyes. Also, the jump scare isn't as scary as I thought it would be. I mean, mainly because most FNAF mobile game, mobile games, most FNAF fan mobile games, jump scares are trash. <coughs> like, look at my games, Final Fantasy Henry's, and the other games, and other games I made like that. Those jump scares suck. The only one I'm proud of in the game series was well, Zach's jump scare in the. First, in the first game, is mainly because like he like 
It's mainly because I worked on it a bit, rather than just like copy and paste. Also, I'm here alone because my parents went shopping. Okay. Be honest. <coughs> also, I'm not joking when I have when I have a cold and a cough. <coughs> That work. Also, when I get a computer, I'm gonna play Five Nights at Charles. Uh, if you don't know what that game is, go look up Andrew Johnson on YouTube. And yeah. You know the fact I have to keep a lookout for six different vents. I hope that music's not copyrighted. I'm just waiting for the animatronic to come in. That's annoying now.
Um. Okay. And. All right. Gonna. What the heck? Okay, they're looking at me. What? Was it, the fire wasn't enough. All right. Yeah, we get it. Burning corpses wasn't enough. Oh, that explains the disconnection. Oh yeah, I forgot to end the video. Um, shout out to Rexter because I would never figure out without his help. Uh, thank you. Now, adios.